Chapter 4 Now Adam slept with his wife Eve, and she became pregnant. When the time came, she gave birth to Cain, and she said, With the Lord's help, I have brought forth a man. Later she gave birth to a second son, and named him Abel. When they grew up, Abel became a shepherd, while Cain was a farmer. At harvest time Cain brought to the Lord a gift of his farm produce, while Abel brought several choice lambs from the best of his flock. The Lord accepted Abel and his offering, but he did not accept Cain and his offering. This made Cain very angry and dejected. Why are you so angry? the Lord asked him. Why do you look so dejected? You will be accepted if you respond in the right way. But if you refuse to respond correctly, then watch out. Sin is waiting to attack and destroy you, and you must subdue it. Later Cain suggested to his brother, Abel, Let's go out into the fields. And while they were there, Cain attacked and killed his brother. Afterward the Lord asked Cain, Where is your brother? Where is Abel? I don't know, Cain retorted. Am I supposed to keep track of him wherever he goes? But the Lord said, What have you done? Listen, your brother's blood cries out to me from the ground. You are hereby banished from the ground you have defiled with your brother's blood. No longer will it yield abundant crops for you, no matter how hard you work. From now on you will be a homeless fugitive on the earth, constantly wandering from place to place. Cain replied to the Lord, My punishment is too great for me to bear. You have banished me from my land and from your presence. You have made me a wandering fugitive. All who see me will try to kill me. The Lord replied, They will not kill you, for I will give seven times your punishment to anyone who does. Then the Lord put a mark on Cain to warn anyone who might try to kill him. So Cain left the Lord's presence and settled in the land of Nod, east of Eden. Then Cain's wife became pregnant and gave birth to a son, and they named him Enoch. When Cain founded a city, he named it Enoch after his son. Enoch was the father of Irad. Irad was the father of Mahujael. Mahujael was the father of Methushael. Methushael was the father of Lamech. Lamech married two women, Ada and Zila. Ada gave birth to a baby named Jabal. He became the first of the herdsmen who live in tents. His brother's name was Jubal, the first musician, the inventor of the harp and flute. To Lamech's other wife, Zila, was born Tubal Cain. He was the first to work with metal, forging instruments of bronze and iron. Tubal Cain had a sister named Naama. One day Lamech said to Ada and Zila, Listen to me, my wives. I have killed a youth who attacked and wounded me. If anyone who kills Cain is to be punished seven times, anyone who takes revenge against me will be punished seventy-seven times. Adam slept with his wife again, and she gave birth to another son. She named him Seth, for she said, God has granted me another son in place of Abel, the one Cain killed. When Seth grew up, he had a son and named him Enosh. It was during his lifetime that people first began to worship the Lord.